Hello. So we want to find the average velocity over these time intervals. So we're going to have to find the difference in the heights divided by the differences in the times. Okay, so I went ahead and calculated out all the heights for the given times. I rounded them off to the nearest third decimal place. So for the interval from two to three, that's going to equal 169.53 minus 114.68 over 3 minus 2. And that works out to be, okay, quit, clear. 114.68 store of a okay. So I got 169.53 minus 114.68. That's going to get me 54.85 divided by 1, which is just 54.85. Point eight five meters per second. Next, I'm going to do 2.5 and 2. That's going to equal 142.313 minus 114.68. Divided by 2.5 minus 2. And that's going to get me 142.313 minus 2 equals 27. Point six three three over point five and that is fifty five point two six six meters per second. Then the next one's going to be 2 and 2.1. That's going to equal 120.248 minus 114.68 divided by 2.1 minus 2. That gets me 20.248 minus 5.568 divided by 0.1, and that equal 55.68. Meters per second. So here's our answers here. I'm going to have to start another screen, but that takes care of the first three intervals. Then we're going to have the interval from two to 2.01, well, that's going to equal 2.01 minus 2. Let me go back and get my number here. 2.01 is 115.23. I think that's a 7. Let me go back and check. Yeah, that's a 7. One fifteen 
point two three seven minus what happens when you get old you can't remember minus one fourteen point six eight and we do that one. One fifteen point two three seven minus that gets us point five five seven over point zero one. Well, that will be fifty five point seven meters per second. And in the last one, we're going to do 2 and 2.001. That will equal 114.736 minus 114.68 divided by 2.001 minus 2. Okay, so 114.736 minus equals 0 0.056 over 2 point, oops, not 2 point, 0 0.001, and that will equal 56 meters per second. So there are our other two average velocities. 55 and 56.